Hi, my name's Simon from Motordrome and today we're going to take a walk around and a drive of uh, this 2004 Land Rover Defender 90 TD5 XS station wagon with uh, very low mileage that's been um, configured as an overlander um, for a spin uh, and a walk around video as well and some engine running action as well at the end. Um, hope you like them, hope they uh, give you the impression you need of the vehicle. Right, let's take this uh, lovely low mileage Land Rover Defender 90 TD5 XS station wagon um, that's been converted with roof tent and awning and all sorts of camping bits and pieces on it for a spin. Um, Speedo's reading just under 53,000 miles. Haven't been through the history yet, but the way it drives, got, I've got no reason to assume that's not correct. Um, right, let's fire it up. All the warning lights come up as they should. And everything goes out as they should, apart from the ABS light, which will go out when we're doing five miles an hour, as it's supposed to. Um, so, starts on the button, no signs of any misfiring, hesitancy or overheating. And unusually for a TD5, it hasn't got a noisy clutch um, thrust push assembly. It's not whining the way they do. This one is, uh, isn't whining at all. Very unusual on a TD5. And actually the drivetrain feels utterly solid. No backlash whatsoever. Um, if I let my foot off sharply, no clunking, nothing. Just gets on with the job, which is another indication that uh, uh, the mileage may well be genuine. As I say, I can't say at the minute until I've actually had a good look at the history. But steers properly, steering wheel is possibly a cup, one very, very slightly off centre, but by very little. Um, if I'm now following a dumper truck that's going quite slowly, but it copes with these bumps and stuff quite happily. There's no um, uh, sinister noises from suspension or anything, it brakes nicely. up this hill nicely. Looking out the back there's no uh, big plumes of blue smoke or anything on the load. No synchro problems on the gearbox at all. It doesn't um, launch going into second or third. Considering it's got the back has all been sort of racked out and what have you, it's almost entirely rattle free. Helps that it's got a spare wheel carrier for the spare wheel on the rear door. But no, it's been very carefully built by the last owner, by the guy that we, we bought it directly from. I think is standard, uh, it's certainly standard ride height. Um, I will have to check the history for that, but it feels like it's standard suspension to me.
pretty faultlessly if you ask me. So, I think there we have it, not much more I can say. Um, my name's Simon, you can reach me in the office on 0118 907 1495, or you can go to our website which is www.moto-drome.com for any more info. Okay, a bit of start up and running action on this uh, low mileage TD5. The immobiliser might have cut in actually. No, there we go. Uh, ABS, light, ABS light stays on as it should until you're doing five miles an hour. You'll have to trust me, it does go out, but it does go out when it does five miles an hour. And the other red light is because I've got the handbrake on. And that is a low mileage TD5. quite happily, no missing or anything. Just doing what it should. So I think there we have it really, not much more to say.